core. Welcome. All right, so welcome everybody. My name is Marnie Hernandez, and today we are doing our certificate workshop for Panama City. So if you're new with us, just wanted to kind of introduce myself and what we do. So these are certificate workshops. They're, they're kind of fun little things that we do together to learn about different destinations, learn about different um, vendors, different programs, et cetera. And I started doing these a couple of years ago because my mentor, my accountability partner kept telling me, when are you going to finish your Disney or your princess cruise training? You know, we want to go on this free cruise together. And I was working full time delivering pizzas and stuff. I'm like, I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. And I kept putting it off and putting it off. Finally, I'm like, the only way I'm going to do this is to put it on my calendar and sit down and do it. Right. And that's what I did. And then I thought, hey, if I'm going to do this training, why don't I see if anybody else in my team wants to do it with me? And so it just came from there. And now, um, you know, we do this three, four times a week uh, with different destinations, different programs. And, and again, it's, it's turned out to be a pretty good little program that we do. It's fun. People, um, people learn. Um, you learn about exciting new destinations, places. Um, besides, again, learning about these places and stuff, you also get invited on promotional material or, or promotional trips, um, uh, lunch and learns, webinars. Okay. Yes, you need to register, guys. Um, no, this isn't certificate workshop. Um, this is this is just certificate uh, training, certificate workshop. If you're trying to get on like new agent orientation, that's a different one. That's a different training that's going on probably right now. Um, this is a certificate workshop where we're going in and learning about Panama. If you're a new agent, you're probably on the wrong one. Um, you can still join us for this um, because again, you know, it's fun, but I do record these and I was just going to show you, um, that I record them and I put them here in my YouTube channel. I also put them, um, in a program that I'll show you. These are all my videos. So I've done the new agent orientation. We just did SeaWorld Discovery Cove. If you missed us the other day for RIU, we ended up doing Discovery Cove and we got our certificate. Guys, you guys get discounts, free SeaWorld tickets, et cetera. That's part one. We still have three more parts to do. Um, but catch up with that because we're going to add that to our calendar for March or for <laughs> December. What day is this? All right. So again, this is my YouTube channel. Please join my YouTube channel. You'll see all my uh, trainings there. So again, today, if for any reason you have to jump off, now you know where the trainings will be. And then also Sandy is amazing in our incentive voucher workshop right here. Um she has all the trainings listed under featured here with the links. We're going to be doing Croatia. We're going to be doing Bosnia, Singapore, Washington, D.C. So you can, yeah, I did too. Thank you, Christina. Congratulations. So RIU, guys, get in and register with them. It does take a little while. We're going to put that back on our calendar also. I did finally get approval for that. Uh, we're doing Washington, D.C. We're doing Intrepid Travel Uplift. We're going to learn about making payments for your clients, okay? All right. So besides, again, having the month there, let me show you another feature here that has all my past trainings for you guys, okay? So again, if you miss it, if you want to join us later or or get in and do the Disney that you haven't been able to do, or or you haven't been able to do the princess training. We've got it right here for you. So right here at the top is all the different programs that you can get in and register for. You can do these trainings all on your own, but they're kind of fun to do together. If you go down the little list, um, the ones in yellow are what we're doing um, this month. Okay, Bosnia, California are ones we still need to do. We're doing Croatia. Um, and then down here, the, you know, the ones we've done. So like Canard, there's a seven part one. Uh, Princess, I think there's a nine, nine part one. Okay, Royal Caribbean, six parts. So besides sitting there trying to find them on my YouTube, Sandy Gunderson has put these all in a link together for you. And yes, I'll share the link with you right here. 
Da, da, da. So you have it again. Make sure you join our certificate workshop. I mean, our incentive voucher uh, Facebook page, and you'll have it. All right. So again, welcome, welcome everybody. Glad you guys could join us. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get started. Again, if you're new with us, what happens is a lot of people will follow along on their phones um, and then do the exam with us online. Okay. Um, otherwise, um, you know, they do a split screen on their on their um, computer. So whatever works best for you guys. My suggestion, don't get in and follow us all the way through and then have to go back and take the test. Get in and get registered now so we can all do the test together. You get your um, certificate and you can post it and you'll be done, right? Um, so again, we wait for you. We don't let anybody fall behind. We make sure everybody passes on the test, okay? So um, if somebody could keep an eye on the chat box, that would be great. Um, if you have questions, make sure you put it to everyone because I'm going to be reading and stuff and running the, the training. Um, so I won't be able to check the chat box. So if you do it direct to me, I may not get back to you. But if you put it to everyone, I have a lot of amazing agents on here to help us. Okay. So as we always say, you're in business for yourself and not by yourself. Okay. So again, this is OTT. Hopefully you've already registered. You're ready to go. Um, hopefully I'm registered. We'll see. If not, it'll pop up and say register. So I'm going to click here. Hopefully you guys are all here. It says Panama Beach. Okay. Let me just go back to home. Just kind of give you a refresher. Make sure. Um, let me see if I go back to OTT and then I'll show you where it's at. Again, uh, we've done these programs before. So hopefully you've already all registered. It's OTT online travel training, just another uh, program that we do out there. Okay. So um, it's listed. It looks like the UK. Is that correct? Are we on the UK again? Um, so I'm going to sign in. Okay. Sign in. And then you're going to look for Panama. So you can like go down here, accommodations, adventures, all of the above, et cetera. Um, they usually write here, courses. Uh, so you can type in Panama here, P-A-N-A-M-A. -A -A. Um, Panama City Beach, there it is. Okay, launch course. All right, so again, if you're trying to register, if you're in the very beginning, make sure the flag is the UK and not the US. Okay. All right, and then you're gonna click Panama City. You're gonna go ahead and click launch. And then you're gonna to get to here. There's three programs, okay? We're gonna do them together. All right. Okay, so everybody in, ready? Again, I will start reading as I read, then, um, then we'll go back and... Um, You'll all take the test together and stuff. Hi, and, is this, uh, I'm sorry. Is this the one we did last week? No, this is a whole new one. Today we're doing oh. Panama. It, it, OTT, though, is, is one of the programs I think we did last week um, because we did that um, Latin America. But today now we're doing Panama City. So you're still in that program. So you're already registered. So you should be able to just go to the UK flag, type in Panama and get right here to Panama City. Okay. So again, I'll put the link in here again. Make sure again, I put, I put this link out there this morning. It's out there the beginning of the month. So everybody should have already pre-registered. That's why I tell everybody to make sure you pre-register for these. So again, we get in um, and get started, okay? Uh, Carol, you are a travel agent or an outside agent or an outside rep, okay? So hopefully that's one of the things. Again, I haven't registered for a while. So um, if anybody can just put in the chat and, and let her know which one you guys put, that would be great. In the meantime, I'm just going to start reading, guys. And as I said, when we get to the test part, we will make sure that everybody is ready for the test. Again, we don't want to leave anybody behind. All right. So Panama City Beach introduction is situated in the northwest coast of Florida. 
27 miles of beautiful beaches, soft white sand, turquoise waters, along with the Gulf of Mexico. Whilst the beautiful beaches are huge draw to the destination, there's so much to love about PCB and you're about to find out why. Enjoy our training. All right, so now we're gonna watch a short video, okay? Uh, good morning, I got my bachelor's. Woo, very good, Chris. All right, and Crystal. Yeah, I actually, I, mean, I hope they have it. We went to Panama. Um, we actually went to Panama and went to San Blas. This is Panama City, so I don't know. I don't think it's the same. Let's watch the video and see. Short video. Find at a beach, dance underneath the stars and on my feet. The sun is always shining for you. White sand and turquoise blue. Oh, let's explore, make it yours. Now we're going to go down. Okay, so let's destination overview. Okay, so now it's going to take us into the lesson. Do you see that? So you're going to click on the first one, destination overview, and that will take you into the program. All right, so Daniela, again, just make sure you register with OTT. Once you get registered, go make sure it's a UK flag and type in Panama, and then you should be able to join us. All right, so Panama City Beach, Florida, module one. Okay, we're going to start the lesson. Again, guys, don't worry if you're still registering. We will wait for you for the test, okay? Just keep your ears open because, you know, when we get to the test, I want you guys to help answer those questions. Team effort, right? All right, so introduction. It's situated um, in the northwest coast of Florida, 27 beautiful beaches, white sand, turquoise waters along the Gulf of Mexico. Whilst the beaches are huge to the draw of the destination, there's so much to love about PCB and you're about to find out why. Enjoy our training. Average temperature is 24 degrees Celsius and approximately 300 days of sunshine per year. All right, so very sunny and exciting there. All right, so getting there, how do we get to Panama City? Panama City Beach has its own airport. Uh, Northwest Florida Beaches International Airport, just 15 minute drive to the beach. You can fly from London Heathrow via Atlanta to Northwest Florida Beaches International Airport with a Delta Airlines Virgin Atlantic Codes share flight. You can also drive to Panama City from New Orleans, which is five hours. These could be test questions. Atlanta, five hours. Orlando, 5.5 hours, okay? So pretty much five hours for many of those main locations, okay? Next. All right, when is the best time to visit Panama City? Whilst Panama City is a year-round destination, there are high and low seasons to take into consideration. We recommend scheduling a visit for your favorite event Find out more in the module. As with most Florida destinations, March is one of the busiest months of the year due to U.S. school holidays. It is still worth um, worth an, in March, but try and avoid U.S. spring break, okay? So again, March is one of the busiest, okay? So I may ask that test question. Um, May through October is a great time to visit. During these months, you can expect the warmest air and water temperature, okay? So May through October. Take advantage of great rates, September and October, both flights and accommodations, all right? So if you're going to sell this, guys, recommend maybe next year, September and October. And then November through February is low season, cooler air, water temperatures, but still lots of fun and events, okay? Keep that in mind. 
All right, the beaches, 2021, Panama Beach was named number two emerging destination in the world by TripAdvisor, Traveler's Choice Award. We haven't already mentioned it, but Panama City's beach has 27 miles of beaches to choose from. Let's hope this comes up in questions at the end, okay? PCB is lucky to have two state parks on the water, giving visitors the opportunity to experience natural and rustic beaches. No trip to PCB is complete without a trip to Shell Island, a ride by private pontoon or a public shuttle to enjoy a day on the unspoiled sands. Next. Water-based fun, whether you want fun on the waves or adventure below them, PCB has an activity to suit. Dolphin excursions, Panama City Beach has a large population of bottlenose dolphins that can often be seen frolicking in the waters around Shell Island. Driving and snorkeling due to the historic wrecks scattered along the coastline, Panama City uh, Beach is dubbed as the shipwreck diving capital of the South. You can also enjoy snorkeling at a state park. Paddle boarding, Panama City Beach is a proximity to all manner of waters, lagoons, lakes, and rivers. Make it a perfect for stand up paddle boarding. You can even try paddle board yoga. But that's not all. You can also enjoy kayaking, jet skiing, parasailing, and airboat rides. Okay, so lots of activities for um, adventures, right? How about nature? Panama City has some of the best parks and recreation areas for visitors to enjoy. You have St. Andrews State Park, boasts 1,200 acres of beautiful beachside landscapes and abundant wildlife. Camp Helen State Park is recognized as a historic site and has the largest coastal dune lake in Florida. The Conservation Park spans 2,900 acres, 24 miles of trails. Explore under dense awnings of cypress trees and follow the boardwalks over the wetlands. Visitors can also hike, bike, swim, spot wildlife, and picnic. Okay, so again, lots of activities. Destination overview. Again, guys, we're going to get close to taking the test. So hopefully you guys are all registered okay. Again, just click in, get, you know, go through uh, our slides that we're going through. And then, as I said, we will wait for you for the test. So dining. Visitors to Panama City Beach will be spoiled by choices when it comes to dining. Low-key beachside restaurants to fine dining fit for president and everything in between. Due to its unique location, Panama City Beach draws gastronomic inspiration from Cajun, barbecue, Creole, American Southern cooking, all mixed with fresh seafood from the Gulf of Mexico. How about uh, for a sweet treat? Head to Thomas Donut and Snack Shop. Locally owned and operated since 1971, this beachside shop has a generous selection of delectable donuts and treats. Let's not forget PCB sunset views at Barefoot on the Beach Bar and Grill. Beach House Bar amongst many others, all right? So you got the donuts, you got the coffee, the snacks, lots of variety, right, for those foodies. All right, and then shopping, who doesn't love to spend money, right? Pier Park, part of Simon Shopping Malls and is Northwest Florida's premier shopping and entertainment destination. This outdoor complex boasts 124 stores, 250 plus shopping, dining and entertainment options. Decor by the Shore has a lineup of some of the most charming local boutique shops. Collect your decor by the shore shopping passport, available at participating stores and the visitor center, and collect stamps as you shop. Then drop by the visitor center for a special souvenir. All right. Did you check on Jason yet? Okay, guys, we're up to the test. So again, want to make sure before we go. Um, won't let me register, so I can't identify that I'm not a robot. I've gotten out and back and still won't work. Okay, Joanne, try doing it on your phone. I don't know why, because, you know, usually I'm it's having, really easy. 
I'm having same that problem. same problem. Me too. Okay. Um, I don't know. Maybe so I had a problem uh, as well. Um, you can bypass that for anyone. You just if you go and click on to the um sign in and then go to sign in by Google and it'll still act like you can't register, but it'll say my profile at the top. If you click on that, it'll automatically go to your profile and you'll get an email. Yeah. Oh, look yeah. there. So, so try okay, the different ways. Yep. Perfect. Thank you. So again, um, we just started on module one. Uh, we just got through reading. We're going to start on the test now. So again, we want to make sure everybody gets in. Um, again, if it doesn't work by your email, go to the Google, go to the Facebook. Um, I think I would go in like through Facebook and it would automatically take me in. Okay. So again, I'll make sure everybody's here because we want to do the test together. Um, while we're waiting really quick, just wanted to share with you on um, Friday, we're doing Uplift. Uplift is a program that we're going to be doing that helps um, give your clients options for payments outside of our vendors. And then uh, Saturday, we're doing Intrepid uh, Travel. So it's another company. Um, next Wednesday, we're doing Washington, D.C. Next Friday, Croatia, Bosnia, and then Singapore. And then uh, uh, calendar, I'm not sure everything we're doing, but I know we're going to finish uh, SeaWorld and um, get those free tickets there. And we have a, a bunch of other ones that we'll be doing that calendar for. Okay. All right. So is everybody ready? Everybody good? No. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I'm All right. Sorry. Yes, um, I'm good now. Let's go ahead with the test. I'm Where not. is Panama City Beach located? Is it on the Atlantic coast, the Northwest coast, or the Gulf Coast, Gulf, Gulf coast of Florida? Northwest coast of Florida. Northwest coast of Florida. All right, thank you. Oops, sorry, hold on, let me minimize this. All right, let's go to the next. Uh, what is the average temperature in Celsius? Is it 24? You guys remember? You may have to unmute yourself. 24. Okay, 24. Perfect. Sorry, I didn't realize I was muted. I said it like four times. That's okay. Like... All right. Uh, name one of the state parks in Panama City Beach. Is it the Everglades? St. Andrews. St. Andrews. All right. <laughs> Look at you guys paying attention. Three out of five so far. Again, guys, if you're still registering or whatever, make sure you take them out, take these answers down or somebody put them in the chat box. That would be great. <clears throat> what is the name of the Panama City Beat International Airport? Uh, is I it the Panama Beach? I think it was Northwest Florida Beach Florida. International Airport. Yeah, Northwest Florida. No, it's Northwest Florida Beaches. Northwest Florida Beaches, that's it. Northwest Florida, guys. And then name one of Panama City Beach's shopping complex. Pier Pier Park. Pier Park. Pier Park. Pier Park. Okay. Pier Park. That is correct. Congratulations. You have now passed the first lesson. We have two more lessons. Again, guys, don't give up. If you're just registering, don't worry. We'll get to the second one. Um, hopefully somebody put the answers in here. If not, just ask us again. We all know the answers will help you, okay? Also, you're talking about how to register for the next program. Remember I showed you at the beginning, um, we have all the programs listed on our um, incentive voucher group right here. And all the links are right here for you, okay? So make sure you join to this and we'll go over that later also. But you have this printout that I gave you guys that has all the programs and the links. And then we also have the programs listed right here with all the links here. Okay. So you guys can pre-register or even do these trainings on your own. Okay. All right. So let's get back to module two now. Again, congratulations, everybody. Let's move on. Now we're going to festivals, events, and activities. So yeah, that's why it's 
again, it's kind of exciting that we do these together. For one thing, again, somebody said they've already you know, been here. They used to go here. So again, it's nice to hear about locals or people that have visited, share ideas, suggestions, et cetera. Also, why not help each other with these pests, right? Some of them can be pretty complicated. Uh, wait till you get to like Disney and to, to Princess. Uh, pretty tough, okay? All right. So let's go ahead and start with festivals, events, and activities. All right, so this is module two, okay? Start the lesson. So these are festivals in the sand, okay? So you have the sand jam, time to rock your socks and flip-flops off at the 2022 Sand Jam Music Festival presented by Pepsi. Three-day festival takes place on the beach and we're headlined by Shine Down 311 and Weezer. You have the Seabreeze Jazz Festival in April. Join jazz fans from all over the world for the Seabreeze Jazz Festival, where world class smooth jazz musicians grace the stage at the Pier Park Amphitheater. And then in se September, Pepsi Gulf Co Coast Jam. Uh, brings the best of today's country music to the beach. Festival goers can see performances from the biggest names in the country music. Past headlines included Tim McGraw, Jason Aldean, Thomas Rhett, Florida Georgia Line, Brad Paisley, and Eric Church, just to name a few. That sounds kind of fun being on the beach rocking, right? All right, how mm -hmm. about events? Mardi Gras and Music Festival. That's in February. Combine the excitement of authentic Mardi Gras celebration with the spectacular beach views. Expect street parades, plenty of beats, and live entertainment for the whole family to enjoy. Pirates of the Seas Festival in October. Panama City, ahoy! Come ashore this Columbus Day weekend for the Pirates of the High Sea Festival. Fun-filled family event with live music, pirate parades, pirate costumes, fireworks, and much more. Now you have New Year's Eve beach ball drop, December. New Year's celebration kicks off with the live music from 5.30, followed by the kids' beach ball drop at 8 p.m. when 10,000 beach balls are dropped onto the crowd. Countdown to Midnight is led by the giant glowing beach ball that descends to ring in the new year. Sounds kind of exciting, huh? Looks like fun. All right, next. Food drink event. Okay, everybody loves food, right? Food truck and craft beer festival in February. Enjoy a weekend of craft beer, great food, games, music, and fun for the whole family. 30 food trucks will be serving everything from barbecue classics, wood-fired pizza, to juicy prime ribs and mac and cheese. Unwindy March. Pack your best frock for Unwindy Panama City's Beach Most Prestigious Event. Uh, hosted together with Southern Living Magazine, the two-day Southern Garden Party curates craft beer, wine, spirits from around the world, as well as culinary creations by the region's leading chefs and finishes with a concert in the park. Cajun Fest, April. Make sure you arrive hungry to the Cajun Fest at Schooners, Mass Local Beach Club. You can take part in the crawfish eating contest or simply take your pick from the many Cajun dishes being served up on the beach. Expect live music, crawfish, themed beach games, and plenty of delicious food. Schooners Lobster Festival and Tournament, October. Tuck in the lobster cooked any way you can imagine during the Schooners Lobster Festival um, and Tournament. This week-long celebration welcomes lobster lovers from near and far. For live music, contests, lots of delicious Florida lobster, of course. And then Oktoberfest, October. Locals and visitors alike will raise a glass and don their lederhosen. That's right, for this annual celebration of German heritage, authentic German beer and breaths. Um, are the star of the show. While this year's festivities will feature Stein hosting competitions, live music, and plenty of activities for children. Next, sporting events. Okay, so now you got your sporting enthusiasts, right? 
Iron Man November. What began as a challenge between groups of Navy SEALs has become one of the most recognized endurance events in the world. Iron Man is a statement of excellence, passion, and commitment that is a true test of mental and physical endurance. The Florida edition of the challenge serves as one of the most popular races on the circuit. Panama City Beach Marathon, December. Get ready to run in paradise. Run alongside award-winning beaches, emerald waters for the marathon, half marathon, 5K, or kids fun run. The 26.2 mile, how many? 26.2 mile race attracts thousands of residents and visitors to the destination year after year, okay? All right, festivals and events. How about attractions? They have the Shipwreck Island Water Park. Slide, float, swim, splash your way around Shipwreck Island Water Park. It's the perfect place for families to spend a day. Race on the slides, relax on the lazy river, or free fall from the thrilling drop slide. Ripley's Believe It or Not Auditorium. When you need a break from the sun, head to Ripley's Panama City Beach. Discover hundreds of fun and weird exhibits from shrunken heads to 70 theater, 7D theater, plenty to keep all the ages entertained. Dave and Buster's, the only place in PCB to eat, drink, play, and watch sports all under one roof. All you need to do is collect your power card at the front desk and let the games begin. And then you have helicopter rides. Don't forget to pack your camera on a scenic helicopter tour of Panama City beaches, beautiful coastline. You have dolphins, stingrays, sea turtles can often be seen as you soar above the Gulf of Mexico, okay? Again, lots of activities, right? To keep your clients busy. And then of course, who doesn't love golf? Panama City's beach, four championship golf courses to choose from including the only Nicholas Design course in Northwest Florida. More of a mini golfer, try putting a hole in one at Goofy Golf. This mini golf attraction remains virtually unchanged since it opened in 1959. Wow. All right, and then the nightlife. Let's party, right? Whether you're looking for country music, EDM, or anything in between, Panama City Beach has a place for you. Head to the nearest beach bar, order a cocktail, watch the sun go down over the Gulf of Mexico, whilst enjoying the acoustic sounds of local musicians. Dig out your cowboy boots for a night of dancing at Tootsie's Orchid Lounge. Place to be for live country music for a night of dancing. Check out the schedule at Club Love Vela for guest DJs and special events. If you prefer to be your own entertainment, try Ms. Newbies for a night of karaoke. You got any singers out here? Now you have your chance, all right? Become a star for the night. All right, and now we have fishing. All right, whether you are interested in deep sea fishing or throwing a line off the pier, there are plenty of options for both novice and pro anglers. Most fishing companies will provide fishing licenses, but visitors can also obtain short-term fishing licenses, okay? All righty, what next, where is he? Okay, test time again, everybody ready to take the test? All right, Veronica, you should be able to log in. Very easy to get logged in, don't worry. We will wait for you. We'll make sure everybody tests. This is only our second test, guys. So again, the first test, we can get you the answers. Very easy to sign in. Again, it says you won't verify. Try going in through Google. Try going in through Facebook. You have three options when you sign in. So try going in through one of the other ones. It will allow you to go up to your profile and you will be able to be get access. Joanne says hit the G link at the top, okay? So again, just try the different options. It will let you in. And again, we've only taken the first test. So if somebody can help Veronica, that would be great. All right. So please select one answer. What is the name of Panama City's Beach Annual Country Music Festival? The Pepsi oh, Golf Pepsi Club. Club. Yep. <laughs> Very good. Pepsi Golf. All right. How about how many championship golf courses? Four. Four. 
four golf courses, okay? So you guys got that? Pepsi golf and then four golf courses. What month did they Iron Man's in November. Iron Man. Oh, I'm sorry. Which, yeah, Iron Man's in November. Iron Man competition is in November. All right, very good. What is the name of the water park, guys? Shipwreck Island. Shipwreck Island. Shipwreck Island. <laughs> Right. Shipwreck Island is the water park. And last but not least, was it Goofy Golf. Golf Course? That is correct. Okay, so Goofy's Mini Golf Course. Five out of five. Congratulations. We're so again. good. <laughs> yeah, you guys you and attention, right? So thank you. Appreciate you guys. All right, last one, and then we get our certificate. So again, if you're still signing on, like Veronica and stuff, don't worry. You will make sure you get all your answers taken care of. We still have one more module to go, okay? All right, let's go. Let's go at it. All right, accommodation. Where are we going to stay? Where are we going to put our clients? So you have to share this open spa resort. Newly renovated Sheraton Golf and Spa Resort nestled along the shores of St. Andrews Bay. This resort offers 320 rooms designed for comfort and relaxation with room and suite options. Along with golf villas across the main resort building, some of which feature full kitchens, it is a retreat for recreation and comfort, perfect for romantic getaways, family holidays, celebration or business events. Facilities include multiple restaurants, three swimming pools, a spa, private beach, two championship golf courses, and a fitness center. So shoot, they don't need to go anywhere. They have everything right there, no, right? <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and do this again. There we go. All right, Hampton Inn and Suites. Okay. Is this uh, like all inclusive? All that stuff? The the uh, the kitchens and the villas and the. No, I'm probably. sorry. The, um, I mean, of course, they're probably depending on what room type they pick. They'll have to, you know, upgrade okay. or whatever. But it it sounds like you know a lot of it is included. Now sometimes they'll say for additional pricing or whatever. So. Okay, um, I was just, in, like the, the restaurants, the swimming pools, spa, the beach. I wonder if those are in a fin. Yeah, they're not all inclusive because um, uh, they're in U.S. We don't have any really all inclusive. I think there was one in Florida that opened up that's a adult only all inclusive. But otherwise, there's no actual all inclusive like they have in like the Caribbean and, and Mexico. So I, I don't think the restaurants are included. I think they're just letting you know the restaurants are there on the premises. But otherwise, it would say all inclusive includes cocktails, food, da da da. Okay. All right. So Hampton Inn and Suites, you. 182. You. You're welcome. Beachfront Hotel, located within walking distance of Pier Park area. The hotel features a beachfront pool, hot tub, fitness center bar, hospitality room, a dune walk over to the beach, golf front boardroom and breakfast seating, okay? And then you have Holiday Inn Resort. Panama City located along white sands of Gulf of Mexico. Rooms feature full-size fridge, microwave, whether guests are looking for action or relaxation. The Holiday Inn Resort offers it all. Guests can enjoy live entertainment, outdoor pool, children's pool, table tennis, and fitness center. And then you have the Holiday Inn Express and Suites Beachfront. So one of Panama City's newest properties provides spacious modern rooms, stunning sea views, complimentary daily express start hot breakfast. Okay, so right there, complimentary hot breakfast. Um, the hotel has a wide array of amenities, lazy river, poolside bar and grill, all set with tropical landscape on the sugar white sands of the Gulf of Mexico. All right, so a lot of these express start hot breakfasts are probably like pre-made little sandwiches or, or like uh, waffle makers or something. Um, a lot of times they'll have those for the, the guests. All right, and then you have Lake Town Wharf. The resort is home to one, two, and three bedroom self-catering units that include kitchen facilities, private balconies, 
Larger units can sleep up to 10 people. Has a soaring collection of oversized floor plans, far-reaching views of the Gulf of Mexico. Lake Town Wharf Resort, also home to Panama City's beach, most comprehensive set of amenities. Resort has five swimming pools, including a rooftop pool, provides private access to the beach, which is just steps away from the resort. All right. And then the new Spring Hill Suites, a brand new contemporary property, 200 suites in an ideal beachfront location. Look at that pool. How cool is that? Hotel has a lazy river swimming pool, fitness center, daily complimentary breakfast. Great location to visit nearby attractions like Shipwreck Island Water Park and Pier Park. Okay, so that would be kind of a fun one for families, right? All right, and then Home Two Suites by Hilton, a newly property, a new property, 2.5 miles from the world's most beautiful beaches. Inside these spacious studios, one bedroom suites, you'll find kitchenette, refrigerator, microwave, free Wi Fi, 42 inch TV, Pier Park Shopping, downtown Panama City are both only 15 minutes away. Pull up in the outdoor pool, curl up at night by the fire pit. Free hot breakfast awaits, and our spin to cycle facility lets you work out while getting your laundry done. All right. So that's kind of nice family uh, place, right? All right. Town Place Suites by Marriott, Pier Park. Okay. Remember, guys, Marriott, if you do the training with Marriott, you get fantastic rates. Okay. Make sure you do your Marriott training. Um, when we were in Orlando or Miami, we got night two nights regularly 175 a night we got it for 71 dollars so marriott has amazing perks for us as agents all right so you have the town place suites conveniently located five minutes from one of florida's top rated beaches right around the corner from upscale dining and shopping relax and feel at home with a fully equipped kitchen and high speed internet access okay Candlewood Suites, properties close to the best shopping restaurants, entertainment that the city has to offer. Candlewood Suites is located 15 minutes away from Northwest Florida Beaches International Airport. Unwind in one of those their hotel suites, which comes equipped with a full kitchen, executive desk, and comfy recliner. All right, what's new and what's coming, okay? So again, you know, this may be an older training, but here you have Spring Hill Suites 2019, Town Place Suites 2020, Candlewood Suites 2020, Hilton Home Suites 2020, Calypso Towers 2022, Homeward Suites by Hilton 2022, Embassy Suites, love Embassy Suites 2022, and Hyatt Place Tower 2022. All right. Time for our last test, guys. How many golf courses does the Sheraton Golf Spa have? It was two. Ding, ding, ding. It is two, okay? I could not along, remember. Along which gulf can you find some of the hotels and the resorts in PCB? Mexico. Gulf of Mexico. Gulf of Mexico, that is correct. And name which resort that has one, two, and three bedroom self catering units. Catering units. <laughs> Lake is, Town. Um, Lake Town. I was actually just saying the information to my mother in law for our next family vacation. <laughs> okay, cool. Look at the little squirrel up there. All right, last one, guys. Does the Spring Hill Suites include mm -hmm. daily complimentary breakfast? Mm -hmm. Is the Spring Hill Suites one that did that? I'm going to say yes. 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 That is correct. Okay, guys. So you have now passed. Print your certificate. You click certificate. It's going to pop up, show you your certificate. You're going to now post that on social media. You're going to tell everybody that now you're a specialist for Panama City. Uh, yes. Look at all these amazing events that they can go to. Look at these amazing yes, hotels that I can put you up at. Look at this water park that I your kids can play at, etc. And so on and so on. Okay. 
So this again, guys, open. we want to make sure Shop everybody is, passes. Okay. okay. That's all correct. So it runs an open shift if I have to put a manual. Just what was number three? Hold the on, let me mute That's everybody it. really quick. Okay, number three, and tell me what the question was. It was Sorry, about you have to the, mute yourself. It was what about was it? the it was about the um um uh, something about the breakfast. It is um the Spring Hill, yes, they include the breakfast. Oh, it's spring. Okay. No, it's not the wharf. Uh, well, no, it's um, Spring Hill. Okay. Yes, thank you. You're welcome. All right, not sure where I added the link on my search bar. All right, so Veronica, did you not get in? Again, um. You should be able to click on this link. Hopefully this is the link. Click that link. That should take you right into the courses. Click on that link if you've already registered. Amanda, click on that link. We'll go through the test questions with you guys. If you haven't registered, again, you can either register by your email, you can register by your Facebook, you can register by Google. I would try all three. All right, congratulations to the ones that passed. Um, we're complete with Yay. our training for today. That was like a quick, short one. Um, again, <laughs> guys, um, you know, the Saturday or Friday, we are doing Uplift, um, 10 a.m. I think it's 10 a.m. What um, is Uplift, Mark? Uplift is like a... Um, a uh, um, payment program kind of like oh. paypal kind of like something you know it's where you'll be able to now like your you, they couldn't qualify for a payment arrangement on expedia tab but they can use uplift and make payments it's i think there's interest included and stuff but it's an option for your client now to be able to make payments oh. on their trip without having to come up with the full amount so again, okay, we'll, we'll learn about that. Um, and that's Friday. I just know Friday. It's, it's, yeah, that's Friday. Uh, okay. Saturday, we're doing Intrepid. Again, if you go to our incentive voucher group, the link is right here. So Uplift is right here. So you're going to click on ah. there. You're going to go ahead and pre-register. Again, you guys can do these okay. trainings on your own, but why not do it with us so we can do the test together, right? So you get an right. Uplift account, you get your certification, you can be able to then post it on social media and say, look, guys, I can help you now budget for your vacations, okay? So that's Uplift. We're doing that Friday Intrepid Travel. Let's see what that one is. So, ba, ba, ba. okay, Uplift, she said, requires us to take a 30-minute test first before we get an account, okay? So again, guys, you Ooh, know, we'll go ahead and learn to do that today, so, then get signed uh, up. Yeah. So um, Intrepid here again. Um, look at this scroll up, Ty, Rick. Turn on, open your curtain. It's right in front of you. Yeah. So Intrepid is here. Um, Intrepid travel. Okay. Um, travelers to Antarctica, the jungles of Costa Rica. So this is going to give us another. Um, you know, resource on, on traveling outside the country. That one we're doing on Saturday. Uh, yes, my Marriott training, again, is right here on this link here. So I shared this with you guys earlier. Um, we've done Marriott. You just go right down here to hotels. Let me pull it up for you. So you go all the way down here to hotels. These are destinations. Again, in yellow, that's where we're doing um, this month, okay? Come on. But Marriott is down here on the hotels. It'll have my YouTube channel, and then it will have the actual link for Marriott, okay? Um, also, with Marriott, with Disney, you guys need a CLIA card. CLIA is now open, so you guys can order your cards. All right, so right up here. Sorry, my fingers moved too fast. Do do Marianne. I had a quick question. Uh-huh. Right here, Marianne. Um, uh, As you see, there's like so, six of them. 
Go ahead. So for the CLIA card, um, I applied for it, but it's not going to be valid till next year, right? Correct. Yeah, yeah, that's why I'm telling you guys, and especially if you guys do any like um, team building or anything, you have to make sure you tell everybody to get their CLIA card, especially a lot of people like to use their Disney cards for the holidays. Well, what happens is yeah. like September and October, they stop selling the CLIA cards, right? The CLIA cards are only from January to December, okay? They stop selling them in September and October and start back up again in November, but for next year. So unless they get their card by September, they can't use their perk at the end of the year, okay? So right here, it's cruising.org. Yeah, have to wait till next year. <laughs> Well, you can do, do it now, but you just can't use the perk. So you can, or I, I suggest yeah. getting your card now, because again, yeah, if you want I to, get it. I have some agents that are uh, booking a Disney cruise. So they want to mm -hmm. book their cruise now, but they need that CLIA number, right? So they are able right. to still now do it, but the cruise is next year, but they're still able to book it now because now they got their 2023 CLIA card. Okay. Okay. So uh, another question I was going uh -huh. through the Marriott training. Right. So once I get my CLIA card number, can I enter it? Even yeah. Though it's not valid? Um, Marriott, okay. you have to have your CLIA oh. and your IATA number with Archer. You have to have both. Okay. Yep. And that'll show you on here for training on that. Okay. How do you post the certificate? Because it comes up as a PDF. So how do you post it? I usually just save it as a picture. And then I just go like over here to my Facebook page. And, and you know, I just go ahead and I, I do everything from my phone. So kind of doing it here, I, I can't really. But I'll, all you do is you <laughs> save it as a picture. Like I do it on my phone and I'd save it as a picture. And then I just go into my pictures and then I go, you know, click. And then I put like, what's on your mind? I post the picture. Hey guys, look at me. You know, I'm a specialist now for blah, 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 blah. You know, so you just get, click here, add pictures, and, you know, and then you post whatever. So um, here's pictures. So with, with the, sorry. Go ahead. With, with the Kia, uh, sorry, I was going to ask a question about Kia. I'll wait till you finish here if you the clear card. Yeah, the clear clear the number the, the number that's displayed right now. We have a clear account. Is that the same number that will become the embark ID clear ID as well? Um okay, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna go here to cruising.org mm -hmm. and it, it gives you the instructions, but let me get to it for you. All right, let me cancel this. Uh, let me get out of here. It's locking me up here. What is on my page that's locking me up? Maybe you I can try the X happened. mark, the X. There's an X there on the I add photos. Did. Yeah. And let me do a control all delete, see if that'll. You probably should on all the windows. Uh, cancel. Okay. Went into pictures. Maybe if I get out of my pictures or something. All right, I'm headed out, Marnie. Thank you again. Okay, congratulations. All right, Thank again, you. We'll, we'll see you guys on um, on Friday. Um, awesome. I'll be posting this training. Yes, um, I will be here. Okay, perfect. Have a great day, I will day, be guys. in the car. Okay. <laughs> I'll be in the car headed to a soccer tournament in Tulsa, but okay. I will be here. <laughs> be safe. Yeah, we were supposed to be heading back to uh, Las Vegas today, but now we're not going to be leaving until probably Friday. So oh, I may be no. doing my training from Starbucks or something. Yeah. So 
um, had a had a little. Well, I look forward to it. Really quick. Yeah. Uh huh. I don't know why. Go ahead. I'm so sorry to interrupt, but can we get your email address? Because I had an incentive voucher um question, and yeah, I know you're um, trying to log off, but can I get your email really quick? Yeah, Marnie. So ask that question. Uh, yeah, or you can ask me here. I mean, people can learn. But um, it's oh, Marnie. Okay. Okay. I, did, I thought you were trying to. Okay. No, I'm just um, trying to get out well, of this I, thing so I can get into something else. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. So I I um joined the group yesterday and okay. it asked me if I watched the video, like the first, you know how you have to answer questions to be able to join groups. It okay. asked me if I watched the video, like the first question was that I watched the video and I, I wasn't aware that we had to watch a video. Yeah, um, um, that's so what I, we're doing. I probably didn't answer that's, the questions right. <laughs> yeah, that's what we're doing now because again, we have so many people um, that are getting in and not paying attention to the training and then they're ordering them wrong. They're not, you know, they're, they're, oh. you know, trying to put wrong information in. So now Sandy, instead of, you know, deleting everybody, she's just saying, okay, you haven't watched the video. I'm going to show you where the video is so you can see it. Um, because oh. it's, it's right there under guides. And so what happens is when you say no, Sandy's going to send you the video. So you can watch it. Okay. Oh, okay. So, through, um, she's going to send it through Facebook. Yeah. She'll send you a message. Yeah. Joanne just posted something. I don't know what she posted again. My okay. computer's not working. Um, but. Uh, Mari, can you just go back into this in a new tab? Can you just go back into this one more yeah, time? It won't let me out of anything. Oh, you see, it's not letting me I'm trying to do. Well, the, the picture that I just posted in the chat, it is um, how Veronica can get in. Okay. Can you let me share screen? Yeah, let me see if it'll allow me. Have you turned off the recording? Yeah. Okay. Hold on. Okay, uh, let me just show 